face my name is Pauline Rogers and I am the face behind Beauty For You and I'm coming from a very windy part of the UK today it is blowing a hoolie out there we've got over 50 mile an hour gusts so <laughs> I'm a little bit more windswept than normal because I've just come back from doing the weekly shop and doing a post office run so I'm worn out so I thought why not come and sit and chat to you so if you're popping on not seeing my face before stick around see if I give you any value and if I resonate with you then please follow and if you can please share I would be truly grateful I don't know why that did that I just wanted to jump in and it's now pulled me back out again come on stupid phone stupid device okay so if you have seen me before or I resonate with you then please uh, follow me and if you can share these videos around guys I have got appreciation jar open so let me know that you shared by putting shared in the comments so that i can add you to my appreciation jar because some two lucky people will be getting a little something from me either a gift or a product credit just for sharing my videos around because i'm doing a 31 day live challenge this is day six and let's get cracking so i'm just going to sprinkle myself around on facebook quickly and then we will get cracking so hi thank you david for popping on how are you um so we are going to get cracking so we're going to use again the eye essentials bundle um i'm going to use the liquid eyeshadows that you can buy singly because they're not available in the bundle i have checked guys and you can't get them in the bundle but you, you can get them singly if you'd like to so we've got the three shades that i spoke about yesterday the colour that I couldn't pronounce properly is actually called Decisive. I now actually know how to say it. <laughs> I've been practising. So we have got that. So you've got Decisive, you have got um, Misty, and we have got uh, Classy. So they are the three colours that are on our website that you can buy singly. And they are limited edition, guys. So once they have gone, they are not coming back. So if you want them... Let me know and I will sort it out. Hi, Jodie. How are you? Quick hi, Beau. Oh, hi, sweetheart. How you doing? Are you busy? Obviously, you better be. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> uh, I love the look of clothes. I know. It's good. I don't know if you saw it yesterday, Jodie. I put it on with uh, Decisive and it's gorgeous. So, yeah, I have all three. So, I'm hoping they're going to bring these back as part of the, the core range with the other liquid eyeshadows because I love them. Right. Let me just get sprinkling and then we will get cracking. So I'm broadcasting on both Instagram and Facebook. So again, if you sprinkle me, then please put you uh, shared me in the comments so that I can add your name to my appreciation jar. And, um, you know, I will get cracking from there because, you know, I, I do appreciate you guys watching me, giving up your valuable time, especially to watch me. I am a hot mess most of the time. Um, I bundle my words, but I am as real as down to earth as you can get what you see is me in the raw and um, i've been outside as you can see i've got no makeup on i went out like this to go and do the shopping so now we're going to glam ourselves up just for you guys so aren't you lucky <laughs> right let me see if i can just sprinkle myself around quickly on facebook and then we will get cracking say that come on tablet don't fail me now so let me know if you do uh, drop on. Let me know. I'm good, Bu. Just go on to walk and dog. Have you got wind up there, uh, Jody? Is it windy? Or have you got a nice... Well, the sun is shining here. It's grey up in the sky and the sun breaks through, but it's very, very windy. I don't know whether it is like that where you are. But let us know where you're watching from if you pop in. If you're new, let me know where you're watching from. Let me know what your weather's like, guys, because down here on the southeast coast of England, it is shocking literally shocking i think this time last year we had storm dennis well i think his brother's come back today because <laughs> it's so windy it's awful right let me see if i can come on tablet come on you've got to let me on my page come on do not fail me now thank you come on come on come on yes thank you thank you don't like it when it doesn't let me on my own page when it says I ain't got permission. I have got permission. I am the page owner. <laughs> Can I not have a permission on my own page? Rude. Absolutely rude. Right. Let's see. If we can. Well, that's interesting. 
<laughs> you are going to play me up, are you? I can't share to my stories because it's not allowing me to. Rude. Okay, let's see if we can get into a few areas and start to find my groups. Bear with me. I know I say this every day, but I wish they were easier to find, but they're not. Because even though I come live every day, Facebook doesn't want to put them all where I can just go dump, dump, dump. It wants to make me find them through my list of groups. <laughs> you are so rude, Facebook. So rude at times. Right, let's see. Let's just do a few. Skip down the dealer. Do that one. And we will do try and find my groups. It's terrible. Why aren't we sticking that one out? Okay, that's the one I want. Thank you. Right, that'll do. That will do me. I've shared a few, so that'll do. So hopefully that will get to me out there and noticed. So uh yeah. Beautiful inside and out. Oh, thank you, Jodie. <laughs> I thought you were going to walk the dog. <laughs> you decided not to now. <laughs> don't blame you. The weather's bad like it is, like we've got. I don't blame you. Don't blame you, girl. It's not very pleasant outside. Right, let's see if we are going to be able to share to any stories on here. It's not letting me do it from my business page. And no. That option has gone, so I can't share it to my stories. Hi, Rob, 93444. Thank you for joining. How are you? I'm not sure if it's for you, if you list your name for Roberta or something like that. But um, stick around, by all means. Right, I can't share to my stories because it's not allowing me to at the moment. So I can't do that. Right. No sun here, just on and off rain. <laughs> Well, yeah, it's a bit like this here. We're we're sort of like on and off with the with the sunshine, but when it does come out, it's it is warm though. You know, I put a sleeve top on, short sleeved, but I'm already too hot. Right. So hopefully you caught my stories this morning, where I did my morning routine as well. Plus some of my morning routine. Come down. Some of my morning routine using some of my favourite um, skincare products. So that's on my storyline, guys. So go and check that out. So you know that I have cleansed. I have used my eye cream. I have used my uh, anti-aging serum. I've used my brightening serum. And I have used my Uology day cream because that's what I do every single morning. And then I do exactly the same in the evening, except for I use my night cream and not my day cream. But I do exactly the same. So we're going to use the powder foundation because I love this. Especially when you open it up and it's sort of like that little sponge sticks its tongue out yeah I know I'm easily pleased right so before we put the powder foundation on we are going to put a primer on so we're going to find the mattifying primer which is eluding me where are you hiding that is my hydrating one someone mattifying primer this is the one that they actually recommend with the powder foundation now if you have got oily skin, then obviously this is going to be the one that you're going to want to go for. Uh, constant tropical Yorkshire, uh, constant typical Yorkshire weather. <laughs> yeah, I think it's just typical British weather all over, Jody. <laughs> to tell the truth, it's not. It's not very good. So if you've got oily skin, then this is going to be your one true uh, face primer that you're going to want to use to put underneath your foundation. Now, if you haven't got oily skin, and you're like me and you're a bit of a mature lady who's got the fine lines and things you are still going to want to use this one because you can use it even if you've got dry skin i've got dry skin in, in places and i have no problem with this whatsoever and i find that it helps to reduce my pores and it helps to smooth out my wrinkles and it helps to mattify my skin and then my makeup sits on my foundation goes on even smoother by using this but i will say and i've said it before if you haven't got a good skin routine, um, it doesn't matter what your makeup you use, you need to get your skin game up for you to have that flawless look with your foundation. 
because if your skin is not at the best it can be then you're going to struggle to get the results that you want so we're just going to put this on and then we are going to put the powder foundation on now the powder foundation came out i think it was a couple of months ago now um it was in this year sometime <laughs> i really should take pay more attention um i'm trying to think when it came out was it february march maybe i'm thinking because what it what it done it came out and it replaced our loose powder and other powder foundation now the reason why it changed is because mo we are sort of like well the, well, the company are making um, cosmetics now that have got skincare built in now this one has got skincare built in i have got a fact sheet here beside me so i can tell you the five main ingredients that are in our powder foundation but it's got light reflecting technology so you if you're like me and you've got bags and you've got fine lines here under your eyes as we get older eye cream helps I use my eye cream every day morning and night but when you put your foundation on to make sure you do not get bit those lines showing up this powder foundation is brilliant for that because it blurs the light and gives you the more smoother appearance on your skin with its uh, light diffusing technology that's actually in the, the powder now it is a powder but it's also a powder that you can use even if you've got dry skin and the reason why you can use it is because it has got skincare ingredients in there that's actually going to help with your dry skin as well so let me just put my glasses on briefly and i can just tell you the names of the five ingredients because i've got the thank you bye, buddy. okay so you've got carolyn which is a natural deliverant clay that helps reduce the appearance of fine line and pores and helps absorb the oils from your face and do and reduce the appearance of shine because because when you've got oily skin you don't want a shiny complexion you want it more matte we again it's talc it's talc free formula so instead of having a talc it's formulated with fine milled silicon for a, for a buttery soft light diffusing effect so that's why it diffuses the light so that it gives you that more um less wrinkled um look to your face because it's going to blur that out for you it's got sheer butter in it a rich conditioned agent comprised of fatty acids that contain a and e and beta car 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 carotene and then you've got caramelline also no also known by a, another name that i can't pronounce uh, flower extract which contains skin nourishing antioxidants oxidants and the main one that most of our skincare products have nowadays which we all know is great is sodium hychlordinate which is a form of hyaluronic acid known for great water retention properties that can help plump and smooth out your appearance of your skin and all that guys is in this little pot of powder foundation it is amazing and i love it because it really does do what it says on the, on the box <laughs> So it ticks my boxes okay so we have put the uh, mattifying primer on which you can see hopefully you can see how it's sort of like sort of like blurred out some of my lines that you may see i don't know whether they will actually pick up on here but maybe you can see maybe you can see on instagram how much i'm sort of like quite red and quite blurred so it's now actually puffing up and making sure that when i put my foundation on my foundation is going to sit where it, it where i want it to be now you can use a little sponge to put it on as i said the sponge is inside this is the organza there's a little sponge if you do use this sponge guys please make sure that you wash it regularly and let it fully dry before placing it back into the into the compact because you want, don't want to make sure it's as hygienic as possible. You don't want bacteria building up on that. But I'm not going to use a sponge. But you can use a sponge for touch-ups during, throughout the day when you tuck this in your handbag. Now you can put it on loosely using a fluffy brush. This is, this is the one that came out that actually came out with this. Which is a nice really fluff one. 
but I like to use my Kabuki brush. Now, a lot of my other Y sisters use this and they were pressing in and fluffing around. Please don't do that with it because you will have a lot of fallout and you'll end up wasting a lot of the products. With your Kabuki brush, this is what I do. I just gently pick it up. It's all you need. And then you've got the little compact there and then you just start to stipple it in. Now I'm hoping that my cam my pictures are good on here so you can stipple it in and then circle it round and actually buff it in to your skin because that is how it's going to sit better. Now this has got up to 12 hours of up to 12 hours of wear. It may go longer depending on what you're doing. You don't need to actually worry about setting it. You can set it if you want, but it doesn't actually need to be set if you don't want to. But I'm hoping you guys can see how this is covering. So this is almost like a full coverage powder which is unheard of in a powder because a powder is usually a, a very light to medium um, coverage but when you use this one because of the other ingredients in there you are going to get a more full coverage as i said you can put it on lightly so you can use it lighter it covers up blemishes it covers up any marks that you've got from old scarring it even will cover up a breakout, the redness. Obviously, it won't cover the, the bump. The bump will still be still be visible, but at least the redness won't be there. So I'm hoping you guys can see how well this is covering. And for a powder foundation, guys, it is absolutely mind-blowing. So as I said, you can try this, guys. If you need a colour match, let me know and I can colour match you. Or if you want to, you can go onto the, the virtual try-on room and you can do a selfie or a live and you can make sure you're standing in natural light that's on you, not artificial light or sunlight. And then you can um, try these on in the virtual try-on room and you can try... The shades on and then see what fits closer or closest to your natural um, skin tone and the good thing is as well guys is all our products are covered by a love it guarantee so if you even get it wrong you get it home and you put it on and it's totally the wrong match you can exchange it if you're not happy with it you can completely have a full refund up to 14 days i don't know of anyone any shop that will allow you to buy a foundation, take it home, break the seal, use it, and then take it back for a full refund. Unheard of. And again, 10% of all our products sold, guys, you are is going to the unique foundation, and you are supporting survivors of child adolescent sexual abuse. So not only are you getting great makeup, got the love it guarantee. 10% of every product sold is also helping the foundation, helping our mission, which is because we are a mission led business and you are helping survivors of child adolescent sexual abuse, which is why our founders, Melanie and Derek, brother and sister, started Unique in the first place, was to help main, well, it was mainly, mainly women who were. Um, who are um, child or adolescent sexually abused. We know that boys are as well. So they have two retreats open. There is online um, community and counselling for these women and to help them, basically give them hope and to rebuild their lives. And 10% of every product that we sell goes to that foundation for that, which I know I don't say enough. Now look at the coverage, isn't that insane? Now you can see how red I was, now I've got just a natural look. As I said, you can put it on loosely as well with the fluffy brush. So you could use your BB cream, if you've got BB cream, and you, if you want your BB cream to be mattified rather than just, because the BB cream, if you know what our BB cream is, is a product 
that is like a moist it's basically a, a moisturizer that is tinted but it, it has enhanced complexion properties if you don't want it to look um, dewy on your face which most moisturizers do you can just use this brush a little bit of the foundation and just go over just to, to give yourself more of a matte look but look at that I think you'll agree that is pretty insane the coverage so that is our newest powder foundation guys as I said it's got all great skincare ingredients so you know that when this is on your face it's not going to prevent your skin from being healthy because it's going to nourish your skin as you wear it as well okay so let's crack on let's get some blusher on uh, not blusher on some bronze on because you know how I like to bronze I'm not a blusher girl but you can get blusher but I prefer a bronze and these are available still on the website so I'm just going to put a little bit of bronzer on because the one thing when you have um, foundation that really does give you that flawless look when it's a full coverage you are going to end up with no definition so by putting a little bit of bronzer on like I've just done get my kabuki brush and I'm just going to basically blend that up and back because I don't want it to see a harsh line I want it to be almost like a, I suppose like an ombre that it just blends into the foundation oh, I keep doing it with that arm my arm my right arm is still giving me a lot of problems I'm still that's one reason why I want to put my hair up but I can't put my hair up because I can't do a ponytail because I can't reach I can reach that arm to there this one I can reach right up but this one I can only reach here so I can't put even put my hair up in a ponytail at the moment guys because I have got a, a shoulder rot rotation cuff injury that is giving me less movement in my right arm than I'd like to have so as you can see we have now got the foundation on so that is our powder foundation so if you want to know more about that then put foundation or powder foundation in the comments and I can come back to you and I can give you any any information that you want I can send you over the fact sheet with all the ingredients and um, we can chat in uh, your inbox so eyebrows I'm going to use the actual one that's come out now that's replaced the old um, eyebrow palette and this one you can pick a pomade and you can pick a powder you can pick two pomades or two powders there is five shades available again if you want to know more about that because I'm not going to go into a lot of details with the with the eyebrows because I mainly want to focus on the eye essentials what I am going to do before I forget is I'm going to put my lash primer and the 4d just down into my top because I want to warm them up so that they flow better so that I know that they're going to um, apply easier on my eyelids so I'm just going to put my just using this is auburn I'm just going to use a little bit of the powder I'm not going to do too much with my eyebrows um, but as you can see my eyebrows do not show up especially around the, 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 the latter quite part of them unless I put some makeup on an eye an eye pencil or an eye palette like so can you see now that they they're there but the, because I'm so fair they don't actually show up and if you're not sure if you've got like me you've got uh, sparse eyebrows and you're not sure where they begin and end best trick is go from the corner of your eye straight up the arch is from the center of your eye up and then the corner of your eye to the back end and that's where your eyebrows should end so if you ever put your eyebrows on that's the guide to basically do it and they don't have to look identical guys because your eyebrows are not twins they're sisters because if you actually photograph one side of your face and then the other side of your face you would see it's not a mirrored image of itself you've actually got two sides of your face and they're slightly different which a lot of people don't realize and these as I say these is the new brow palette again I haven't got the fact sheet with me up here but the fact sheet again you've got all skincare ingredients in here my favorite was this one which if you watched me before which you can see I've got loads left even though I've been using it for two years but you can't uh, once they run out you can't change the individual sections on the um, palette this one you've got the individual discs that you pop out because they're magnetic 
little hole on the back and you can take them out when they run out and get a replacement get a refill so that makes it a little bit more economical for you and the thing is if you wanted to one day go for a slightly darker eyebrow or a lighter eyebrow you could get yourself one dark one light um, pomade or powder and then you can swap and change because we have got in, in the old brow palette we only had three we had uh, blonde uh, medium and dark with these I'm trying not to glare you too much from the mirror with these we have got blonde light brown auburn dark brown and black so you've got five shades to choose from so basically it caters for everybody out there who needs eyebrows which is great and again up to 12 hours wear so you don't need to set it so there's my eyebrows on okay so that is my basically my base face done eyebrows foundation and um bronzed <sighs> terrible i am actually telling my brain is like swiss cheese i'm trying to keep this quite short today i don't know how well i'm doing <laughs> uh oh 28 minutes oh not too bad right okay so we're going to go on i'm just going to use two again if you tuned into my life yesterday we used um decisive and we used uh classic um yeah classy today i'm actually going to use misty and classy so this is actually like a gray uh matte silvery or silvery gray hopefully you can see that why do i lift my arms up and then my things decide to move and put me off so that is um misty and then we're going to lighten up on the eyelid with classy because i absolutely love this one guys and that's classy and I think they're going to look nice together. So basically we're going to do like a silvery smoky eye effect. So we don't need to prime. Though you should prime. But I'm not going to. And if you are like me. And you are a mature skin. Or you've got you know, you've got a hooded, eye, hooded eyelid. And you've got quite uh, deep uh, wrinkles on your eyelids. The liquid eyeshadows are the best for that. Hi Polly Hunter. Breeze. Thanks for joining. You are going to um, love these because they're easy to apply and they do not crease up. So if you are a mature lady like myself, then these are ideal because they go matte. They, you know, when they're on, they're wet, but when, when you've blended them, they go matte and they don't crease up, which I absolutely love. So we're going to go on. I'm going to use this palette because I'm used easier with this one. I'm just going to get a little brush which I'm just going to make sure is clean there is no other stuff on there and another one as well just to put the other one on with okay so we have got two clean brushes so as I said this is a liquid now you can put these in your bag you know they're not going to leak out they've got a little doe foot applicator which you can use to apply it if you want to um you can use your fingers if you want to as well but as i said it's a liquid guys but look it's not going to pour out so i'm going to put this i'm going to use my trusted little mirror here i'm just going to put this along my crease now i'm going to do one eye at a time because once these are, once you start to do them, if you want to blend them out, then blend them straight away. Don't wait because once these are babies are dry, they are not going to budge because they are splash proof and they are smudge proof. So they are not going to budge. You actually end up. Um, with it concentrated and you won't be able to blend it i like to start with a little bit and basically work it where i want it 
But can you see how easy that is? Now, if you have got a hooded eye like me, go up a little bit past your crease into your transition just so you open that eye up a little bit more. Look how easy that was. It's insane. It is so quick and easy to apply, guys. And again, just going to put that on my line there. Just start to blend. So if you are nervous of eyeshadow, these are going to be your one to go to, guys. As I said, we've got eight originals on the website. And we've got three that are limited edition. So the limited edition ones, they are around all the time stock lasts. Obviously, once stock has gone, they've gone. But can you see how quick I just I love it. Look, look how quick and easy that was to apply. Isn't that a gorgeous colour? I say it's like a, 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 a silvery grey. Because when it's wet, it's very silvery. And it's more of a, it, and then it goes to like a grey colour when it's when it's dried and you've blended it out a little bit. But look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, I love it. Absolutely love it. So that's that done. And then we're going to go on with the classy. And what we're going to do with this one is we're going to put this on our eyelids. So we're going to start in the inner and we're going to go over to possibly about just about halfway like so and then we are going to blend with a cleaner brush with a clean brush so we're just going to blend not too much just enough that it blends into each other because then what that does can you see the difference can you see that so you've actually opened and made that lighter in that corner, which is going to make your eyes pop more. So quick and easy. Now you can get one of the eyeshadows with a liquid eyeliner or pencil eyeliner and a 4D or a twisted mascara. That is my eye essential bundle, guys. With a 21% saving. So if you are interested in Eye Essential, put Eye Essential in the comments and I will um, get back to you. So if you're just popping on, my name is Pauline Rogers and I am the face behind Beauty for You. So if I give you any value or I resonate with you, then please follow guys and please if you can share because i've got appreciation jar open but look at that how quick and easy that was okay so we also got a july bundle out which is a lip exfoliator and you can chew you've got, you've got two hotties our original hottie or our special edition hottie which is a nude color and all these three again are 25% saving you don't have to have the both you can have them in both in clear or both in the colored or one of each these are our lip plumpers guys so if you are somebody that always wanted a bit more fuller lip use the clear at night use the lip the colored one during the day then you've got some color on your lip or you can use clear and clear you can actually go over your lipstick if you want I'm going to use the color one just to show you I'm going to put it on now so hopefully by the time I've done my eyelashes, you will see how much more plumper my lips. Look at that, isn't that a nice colour? It is such a new colour, guys. It is beautiful. So I'm going to leave that on. I can feel it tingling. It's got peppermint in it, which is going to help to plump up your lips. And if you're like me as well, where you've got the fine lines on the top of your lip, when your lips are more puffed up or more plumped up, those lines are going to be less noticeable because they are basically going to stretch out as your lip plumps up. The more you use it, the more your lips will plump up. So if you are somebody who does have lip fillers 
and it's probably very expensive lip fillers i should think try these guys because you've got a love it guarantee you can get all three in the uh, july bundle i am have got a few ladies who only want one or want two of the products if you are interested but you only want to get one let me know because i may have somebody who only wants one as well or wants two of the items and then we can sort something out for you but let me know in the comments if you want to try our hotties as i said everything's coming by i love it guarantee guys so you've got nothing to lose now i am going to comb through my lashes i have dug out and i'm scared i'm not going to tell you that i'm, I'm scared because i don't use these lash curler but we are going to go ahead looks like torture for your eyes so bear with me i may end up hurting myself this i want in the center I just want to try and help curl my flat lashes. Which I find this quite hard to do because my lashes are quite short. They are a lot longer than they used to be because I use the lash serum. But I just find they Let's curl them a little bit. We've done a great deal. I'll, I'll practice with that. Right. So I'm going to go on with the lash primer because we should always wear a lash primer. And so the lash primer is not part of the eye essentials, guys. But if you want it, we can add it and you can save yourself some more money because a lash primer is something you should be using, especially if you wear um, waterproof mascara. Because you want to protect your lashes and look after your lashes. Now, we're using the 4D that has got bran, ricin and other good ingredients. It is fibre infused, so it's going to lock onto each other and it's going to help build volume and length to your lashes. So if you are a woman who wears extensions, and I know you have to have a break every now and again from your extensions, then you have got a 4D mascara that's going to give you the false eyelash look but without having to have extensions on so if you are on a break or you're coming up to a break where you have to uh, give your eyelashes a breather from your extensions then please let me know guys and I can hook you up with our mascara that is going to help give you longer fuller lashes I don't know why that seems to be a funny shape. I don't know whether that's got bashed or something. I wonder why I'm having I mean, awkward putting that on because it looks, looks a bit bent, my wand. <laughs> I obviously bent it at some point. Now, I say this lash primer won an award. So it's going to condition your lashes. It's going to um, nourish your lashes at the same time. Our original Epic and our Twisted Epic, which you can get in the uh, bundle, has got... Um, Biotin, waxes and other great stuff that's actually going to promote lash growth like our, like our uh, lash serum does. So if you were to wear our Epic Twisted every single day, you would have longer lashes because it would help grow your lashes. Okay, just going to leave that for a few seconds. So while that's just doing, I just want to touch on quickly... Um, if you're free at 7 p.m. UK time tonight and you have been following me and you're interested in jumping on board and coming to meet my uh, company, there is a Meet Unique webinar at 7 p.m. UK time tonight with uh, Louise White. Now, if you want to jump on that, let me know. I can send you the registration for it. It's totally free, guys. They can't see you, they can't hear you, so you can turn up in your pyjamas and a glass of wine, that's fine. Louise does give up, does giveaways for a free mascara, so you're in a chance to win a free mascara as well, which is worth it. But come and meet Unique. She will give you more insight about our business, about how we are paid, our mission, and any other bits and pieces that are, are, are questions you may have. 
if you want to do, join me then come and join me on the webinar tonight at 7 p.m uk time i'm not sure what that is in america i think that's about seven i think about 2 p.m in the afternoon I'm, I'm guessing depending on where you are in the us i'm not sure about the other time zones but if you want to let me know and i can give you the link and you can register and it will give you the time zone for that but it's a seven o'clock p.m uk time every tuesday night we have this webinar for you to jump on and find out more about unique because i used to bang on about our beauty box we have now got a lower entry guy so if the beauty box price put you off and you wanted to join and thought oh, i can't really afford that map you can uh, now can jump on board guys for the price of a 4d mascara and a five pound extra fee that's it and you can join unique and then you can start running and um, earning yourself income at home your website is up and running instantly and I've got things in place that I can help mentor you hi thank you for dropping on um, can't see this at Ferno Beauty thank you for joining um, but if you want to know about the brand let me know guys and I can give you that link to register to meet unique as I said they can't see you they can't hear you if you want to ask questions you just basically like you do on here you just tap it in and put it in the comments and somebody will answer your questions so if you're interested in meet unique tonight guys it's every when every tuesday at 7 30 p.m if you want to get on that webinar let me know right let's finish this off with the 4d because i was trying to keep this under half hour but i think i've already failed yep <laughs> right 4d Pull it out carefully. This one holds an insane amount of, of mascara on there, guys, because it's got a flat side and a um, short side. It is going to lift and give you longer, fuller lashes. Now, because I've got such tiny lashes, I like to remove as much of the product, especially the fact because it's a new tube. I'm just going to do this quickly just to show you because it just holds so much can you see the amount that is in that tube that I've scraped off now this one you're supposed to go wiggle 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 roll I still can't do it after two years but just take your time when you put this on and I like to do is get into my lash line and I do wiggle backwards and forwards but I don't roll I blink And then once I've got where I want it on the on, on right up on my lash line, then I will start to roll this baby through my lashes. And if you find you can't do a complete roll of the wand, flick it round and then use the other side and roll. Because I find that works well as well. But take your time. This is fiber infused, one step. It's going to give you thicker, longer lashes. Now that's just one little coat. If I look down. Can you see the difference in my length of my lashes when I look down? Say, so I just tidy a little bit on the bottom just to finish that off. You do a lovely little bit on the bottom on this one. Because I know a lot of you don't like to wear a great deal of mascara on your bottom lashes, which is fair enough. In fact, you can just use the tip of the wand and just go backwards and forwards with it. And then you've got enough on there to carry on to start doing the other eye. Now, when you put the lash primer on, you can let it go dry. You can let it go tacky. You can still put your mascara on straight away after putting on the eye primer. It's entirely up to you guys. You find what works best for your lashes. As I said, this has got fibres in it. So every time you coat, they're locking onto each other. That is going to give you longer, thicker, almost like you're wearing extensions, lashes. That you know and I know that is our amazing 4D. Now this is our core product, guys. 
it is the one that you can join the company with it launched in may of 2019 um yeah may of 2019 a month after i joined and it broke our internet we sold i think over two million in two hours or something like that when it when it launched so it is the one must have mascara that everybody's raving so if you want to try this and you've never tried it you've got a love it guarantee guys and again you can try it for 14 days if you're not happy with it for whatever reason you can refund in full but i think a lot of you once you get this baby in your hands you won't want to now i use my lash comb because again as i said my lashes are so straight that i want to try and get as much curl into them as i can so i use my lash comb in between my coats and if you notice i have not double dipped because it's insane the amount of, of mascara is actually on this one guys and if you take away the excess then you're not going to clump and it's going to keep it all flowing beautifully I absolutely love hoarding because it gives me that longer thicker lash look it just makes my eyes more youthful so as I said if you are a lady who is um, wearing extensions at the moment and you're due to have your extensions soaked off and you've got to have a rest period then try this guys I will show you in a minute, I will keep you in. When you finish doing your first or second coat, wipe off at the top of the nozzle what you scraped off and then just push it down, screw it up. Do not pump. It's a non-drying formula. You should never pump your mascaras because you're pumping air in there that's going to dry your mascara out and you're also going to push bacteria into your tube. The recommendation is if you use a mascara four or five times a week, three months you ditch that tube whether you've used it or not all up because the bacteria in there guys is growing and you do not want any eye irritation from wearing mascara that is over three months old and i know we're all guilty of it because i was as well of having one tube of mascara and actually being quite chuffed with yourself going oh i opened this a year ago and it's still going <laughs> it's not something we want to do really and if you do get anything on your eyelid have a little spoolie and you can basically clear it up and if you do get any more like me messy thing you can just touch up with your brush so that is just two little coats whoop i need not off the table of 4d on my lashes so i'm going to look down for you i'm going to look to the side and I do have a hooded eye, so I'm going to tip my head up as far as I can without you seeing up my nose and look up so you can see. And I hope you can see the length on my lashes now. As I said, I've got the tiniest lashes on the planet. You've got slightly longer lashes than me, you're going to get a better result. And you can buy the lash serum, the lash primer and a 4D or our Epic Twisted or the Original in a in a trio guys and save yourself money and again you can um have lash care for your lashes so that is it guys that is my look done hopefully if you enjoyed it hope you like the colors as i said any information of any of the colors that i've used the products i've used if you um, wanted to know what they are then please put a comment down in the Fred and I will be answering you but as I said if I've resonated with you and you've never seen me before my name is Pauline Rogers and I am the face behind beauty for you and if you're still watching this on the if you're watching this on the replay which I should have said in the beginning and I forgot if you're watching it on the replay and you'll notice on the replay because you won't see a live in the top corner please still comment and let me know where you're watching from because I will like to come back and thank you personally for giving up your time to watch me so I will be live again tomorrow at 1.30 here 
on these pages and i see you then so all take care but as i say if you want to get on the uh, meet unique call tonight the webinar then put meet unique in the comments and i will send you over that registration link so thanks for watching guys take care and i'll see you tomorrow bye Bye on Facebook. Catch you soon.